Hey friends, there are always millions of experiments happening around the world. While some can lead to incredible discoveries such as penicillin, some can bring a lot of trouble. Humans have done some daring experiments in the past that could have destroyed the world, but didn't. In this video, we will take you across the top 5 such experiments. But before we begin, do not forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the like button below. Now, let's get started. The Top 5 Experiments That Could Have Destroyed the World Number 5. Kola Super Deep Hole In 1970, a Soviet experiment was initiated according to which the world's most bottomless hole was to be dug. The scientists of Russia started digging the hole in the Arctic Circle, and by 1994, they had already reached the depth of 12 kilometers. But that was just the beginning. The project continued, and in 1989, Russians could dig around 40,230 feet deep in the ground. They had made their way to the Baltic continental crust by this time. The hole provided a medium for many scientific discoveries, such as the 24 different species of ancient microscopic plankton fossils found. Although no substantial damage came about, the experiment was surrounded by many negative views as well. Many researchers feared that the investigation would have ended up in something terrifying, such as cracking the world up into two halves. Number 4. The Trinity Test The word nuclear bomb indicates trouble and damage. But here we are talking about the experiment that included the tested atomic bomb. Americans and Europeans, desperate to dominate the Nazi government, introduced a reticent project called the Manhattan Project. Under this project, both the groups were working to bring out a potent weapon that could become their strength in World War II. Soon, the Manhattan Project reached its first stage of creating the world's first nuclear weapon. Now it has to be tested and observed how powerful it was. On July 16, 1945, they launched their Trinity test, according to which the nuclear bomb was to be tested in the New Mexico desert. Even though the scientists were quite convinced that the experiment would work out well, many people feared that this test would mark the end of the world. The test was carried out, and no damages came out. However, it made humanity aware of how much power the weapon carries, that it could end the world in one shot. This experiment also marked the beginning of the atomic age, where nuclear power outweighed human strength to a large extent. The Hindu scripture Bhagavad Gita was so convinced by the damage the test would cause that he stated, "Now." I become death, the destroyer of worlds." A letter from Albert Einstein to the U.S. President also stated the potential danger the weapon could cause. The letter reads, A single bomb of this type, carried by boat and exploded in a port, might destroy the whole port with some of the surrounding territories. Even the Brigadier General of the project had doubts about the project. He is known to have said, no artificial phenomenon of such tremendous power had ever occurred before. The lighting effects begared the description. The whole country was lighted by a searing light with an intensity many times that of the midday sun. <sighs> Number 3. Large Hadron Collider Placed in Switzerland, the Large Hadron Collider is probably the largest and most urban scientific instrument. It was a product of the European Laboratory for Nuclear Research or CERN, situated near Geneva. The tool was built to study particle physics profoundly and intensively. The machine was built after so much research and work that it is held responsible for storing earthquakes and attracting asteroids toward the planet Earth. This theory is circulated and believed by some people because a giant magnet weighing around 1920 tons is placed in the center of the collider. Apart from this, many people also say that this gigantic device 
is also responsible for creating black holes in the Earth, the type of holes that could swallow anything in themselves. However, the association behind running this experiment has seemingly disapproved of all these conspiracy theories. A statement by CERN concluded that even though the LHC is not hazardous to the Earth, it could, to some extent, produce a black hole. The LHC will not generate black holes in the cosmological sense. However, some theories suggest that the formation of tiny quantum black holes may be possible. The observation of such an event would be thrilling in terms of our understanding of the universe and would be perfectly safe. Number 2. The Tuskegee Syphilis Experiment the Tuskegee Syphilis Experiment is next on our list of experiments that could have marked the end of the planet Earth. It was a study funded by the government. It was carried out from 1932 till 1972. In this experiment, 399 Africans suffering from syphilis were stopped from taking any treatment. Back then, even penicillin was proven to treat syphilis. But those unfortunate 399 patients were lied to about their diagnosis and given placebos as a way to cure. The real question is, what was the reason behind doing such an inhumane thing? It was an experiment being carried out under the supervision of the U.S. Department of Public Health Service. The main motive was to track how syphilis would react if left wholly untouched and untreated. The answer is, as you guessed, it was lethal. 28 of the people involved in the experiment died from syphilis, whereas 100 of them died due to other related issues. The experiment was considered unethical because no evidence is there to prove that the 399 patients involved were taking consent before becoming a part of this study. Many sources also say that the doctors kept their condition hidden or created other diagnoses such as bad blood. The patients involved in this study were black Negro men of 25 years or older, but some women also caught syphilis from the men left untreated. The community of whistleblowers finally ended this tragic study after 40 years in 1972 by introducing the phenomenon of medical ethics. Studies suggest that the side effects of the experiment extended to the whole of the black culture after those 399 men were left untreated. It also leads a vast majority of the black community to not believe in doctors' words. Even today, many of them think that they are being exploited for the physician's interest and curiosity. Number 1. Guatemalan STD Study Down to the last one. The Guatemalan sexually transmitted disease was probably one of the darkest medical experiments the United States has ever carried out. The study was so unethical and violated the medical limitations in so many places that U.S. President Barack Obama apologized for it in 2016. The U.S. court itself pleaded guilty to ruining so many lives. The study was initiated in 1946 and was carried out for 10 years till 1956. In this experiment, 1,500 citizens of Guatemala were forced to become a subject and were sexually transmitted to different diseases such as syphilis. The people who became the subject of this horrid experiment were mainly orphans, prisoners, or prostitutes. The study subjects were injected with different diseases from the bodies of opposite genders and were not treated to see where it would take them. But all it would lead to is the subject seeing a painful end to their life. The Guatemalan STD study damaged the victims' families, and they are now stubborn about suing Johns Hopkins and any other universities that contributed to this experiment. The U.S. Department of Health and Prevention has also given $1.8 million to treat HIV and STDs rising in Guatemala. That's all for today, guys. We believe this information was valuable to you. We appreciate your trust in our research. Please leave a like for this video. Also, comment down and tell us what you want more from us. We will appreciate your feedback and suggestions. 
If you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you soon in the following video. Stay tuned and connected.